Uganda is a very beautiful country. Uganda is a very green country during the normal rains. Very green and it is called the Pearl of Africa because of its fertility. It's so fertile. In the past, we used to live very well. We had our two seasons in a year. But from 2007, we have been having floods and drought. Floods and drought. You find that immediately after the, the floods, the drought come and it is a prolonged drought. It comes and clears every food that we have. And when the, the floods come, it sweeps away the, the, the crops we have in the gardens, the houses we have. Go, the people's lives are taken away. There are so many changes. During the floods, you find more deaths in the village due to the contaminated water. When there is malaria, because of the mosquitoes, there is a lot of malaria. There is cholera, there is diarrhea. You find many people dying, more so the infants, die because of those diseases, because they can't resist. And during the, the, the drought, you find people going without food. People may have a meal a day. Many things happening in the negative way that used not to happen. At first, we are putting that it was God trying to punish his people. But in my community, when they learned that it was man-made, they began asking, now, if you are there, what are they going to do for us? One. Two, if they are the ones doing all this, will they cut the emission so that we can go back to our normal life? And we always give them hope. Say, yes, we are trying and there is hope. I don't think they will want to move. They want adaptation funds to be given to them, at least to adapt with the situation, because they don't know when it will, the, the, the climate will go back to normal. Because if it is just like that, the generations will not be there. We shall, the next generation will not come up. In my home, I will get my children there. I will get my relatives come to see me. I will get all my friends come to see me. I will get everything good I will get from my home. So home is something very important in my life.